Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how to, if you like have like some Trackmaster Gordon or like a Henry, I'm going to show you how to make custom side rods. So like the side rods normally come like this. I'll show you how to make the custom ones in case you're wondering. So you just get a um, piece of paper, cut it into a square and then make like little lines with the black Sharpie. You stick it on, like using clay or something. I'm using clay. So like there it's stuck on probably looks like a vent, but it will not be a vent. Then you're gonna cut a long piece and put a black dot at the end. Like that. Well not too long, but not too short. Like a good size. Like you're gonna stick it on whatever with whatever you're using. I recommend not using like glue, hot like glue, like super glue or like something. Because, like, I recommend using clay because, like, like, what if you accidentally glue it and, like, when you, like, test run it, like, it doesn't, and, like, sometimes it, like, goes, like, that. And, like, you don't want that happening whenever you, like, make your engine, like, move. This is, like, an old Gordon that, like, messed, it was, like, messed up. It was, like, well, no offense to Will Thomas, I made you out of a messed up cord and hopefully that doesn't like like make you like sad or mad or whatever because like this is the only Gordon I ever had and I thought I would turn it into you it was my only ever Gordon I had but then I came along and bought a Trackmaster one I mean a take play one but this was my first ever Trackmaster Gordon all of this right here my first ever track was recording, except the tender, like, tender's different. You guys know that. And so, one second, the guys, the phone is ringing. So yeah, guys. So yeah, guys. This is just how to do the custom side rods. Like they look really cool in your engines. Like when they go like, really fast, it looks like really cool. So I did this with Will Thomas, my customer Will Thomas. So yeah. That's how to make your own custom side rods. This is Thomas Productions signing out.